welcome back to the Jen Camp Meyer Show. I'm Jen, and today I have Jim Meyer of Meyer Photography. Hi, how are you doing? Doing good, how are you? Wonderful, thanks for coming in. Absolutely. So photography, uh, the closest I get is my Blackberry taking a picture, so I, that is not professional whatsoever. <laughs> um, so your, your trends are families and kids, is that what your focal point is on? Yeah, we specialize in newborns and families. We do a world of other things as well at our studio, but we love shooting the newborns and the little ones and watching them grow those first few years. Okay, that's a lot of patience right there. I salute you for that. So tell me, okay, so we've got a one-year-old and a three-year-old, and I'm a mom coming in. How should I prepare for a photo shoot? Give me some um, tips around that. For a one-year-old and a three-year-old, I would just uh, warn you to come in with some patience. Okay. Um, a lot of times what we'll do is just try to make sure the kids are comfortable. That normally takes a good 15 minutes or so. Okay. Uh, we just try to have fun with it, try to capture them, capture their personality, mm -hmm. and then hope for the best. Clothing items, should I prepare a couple different change of clothes? Can I just come in one? Or what do you typically see? Um, we would typically recommend about two outfits just to have some variety if we're going to do something in the studio and then something outside or, you know, just depending on the time of year. But normally two outfits is plenty. By the end of two outfits, you normally lost their, their attention. They're so. gone. Exactly. They're done. <laughs> exactly. How long does a typical session last? Our sessions are about 30 minutes. We found that to be a really good window for keeping their attention, keeping it fun. After that, they're you know they're ready to do something else or go home. Fabulous. <laughs> um, as far as a budget, because I mean that probably runs the gamut. So I don't get sticker shock. What should I be looking at? Maybe for a range of you know a couple pictures to a whole wall portrait type of stuff. That really depends. There's different price points for you know whatever someone might want. Mm -hmm. If they're just wanting some some prints for their desk at work or you know for the mantle at home, you're probably not going to have to you know dip into the savings account. Okay. When you get into the wall art, that's where more of the investment comes in. Um, that could range anywhere from a few hundred dollars up to you know into the thousands, depending on what kind of pieces you want and and the, and the quality and the size. Fabulous. And, but you consult and work with your clients and kind of stay within the budget and recommend maybe this size or this picture or so forth. So Absolutely. A lot of times we'll try to plan if, if they have a spot on the wall they want to fill, mm -hmm. we'll maybe come up with a custom idea for that to make sure it, it fits and, and works well for their space. Great. And as far as what are the hot you know items right now as far as shooting? Is it more inside? Is it outside? Are they bringing like lovies or something or you know? How, what's going on in that area? With newborns, it seems to be custom studio stuff. Um, a lot of people are wanting to do more of the, the antique, um, mm, like baby yeah, scales, yes. and make it look like it's in an old room. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of people like to do something kind of outside, which is a lot more difficult with a newborn, keeping them comfortable and sure. calm and, and you know somewhat quiet space is really hard to accomplish outside. Fabulous. Well, I appreciate you coming in and taking the time. Absolutely. Um, this has been Jen on Jen Kantmeyer Show, and we'll see you real soon.